Good afternoon and welcome to Princess Channel, the channel with authentic information and all information you may require for financial freedom, grants, cryptocurrencies and other stuffs. Oh, this afternoon we about to break an information about the pre disbursement memo uh, and this is in preparation for the disbursement that is about to happen i'm going to get across the intel for us to understand that we are just at the verge very close to disbursement and things you need to do very carefully pertaining to your banking account pertaining to your uh, the limit that is set on your account pertaining to your banks if they've entered dormancy uh, just ensure that you clean up the house so that nothing would be returned back to the cbn by the time the alert hit your bank account and discover that it has been left passive for too long or inadequate uh, sanctions are on them to ensure that the the, the money does not return back to the cbn so these are the pre disbursement information and memo that we're expecting to get in time before this busman happens uh, if you're new to our channel kindly subscribe to this channel and also hit the notification bell so that you don't get to miss out on any of our important update today is the 25th of october and today is friday we're just heading to the end of this week uh 2024 and um you are here to listen to this very important update coming from the organs of uaag and it is tagged pre disbursement memo in other words predisbursement information that is the information you need to get to get yourself preparatory towards disbursement all right and this is coming from one of the channels of uh, uag uh, disbursement information route so get this now clearly um warm greetings i trust this meets you well in the preparation for upcoming disbursement and fostering adequate measures to fast track disbursement in seconds it is advised that as all banks are 98 percent rounding off their banking system upgrades since the last two weeks reach out to your loved ones friends or families who have opted out and lost their lines or vehemently thrown their hopes in the dust to pick up their contacts and get to massive works from now all dormant accounts should as a matter of urgency be reactivated from today the 25th of october 2024 or any fund dropping there would be automatically withdrawn back to cbn did you get that all coordinators and major leaders in the grant space including all applicants supposed beneficiaries covering new or old registrations should utilize these few days of perfection to ascertain their level of assurance for disbursement whether as an applicant or as a cluster head or as a sponsor or as a coordinator or as a super coordinators or and, and, and the rest of them the list is continuous all right so this is the information that we have pray for uag supreme theobard and saint rita also pray for vigo he who hears the words of the town crier and takes heed is considered as a wise man so importantly from today 22 from today 25th of october 2024 you are to ensure that every account that is dormant every account that has been left redundant and passive a couple of months ago there was a video that was dropped on this channel to let us know the account 
that is dormant. You know, the account that has been left in, unoperational or inoperational for like the past six months or something like that, around, around about the time for the past six months or something like that, banks will consider it as a passive or dormant account. And possibly if that is the account that you dropped for the receival of your fund in UAG disbursement and you've left it unoperational for the past six months, no matter how much is there, whether 80,000, whether 2,000, whether 5,000, once it has been declared passive and redundant by the bank, any fund coming from CBN or any source into that bank, it will reverberate back. It will automatically reverberate back to the CBN. So you wouldn't that kind of an account will not hold funds anymore until you go back to the bank and reignite it. You have to reactivate it. And with the information we got now from the organs of UAAG, you should start that process from today, the 25th of October 2024, so that while others are smiling, you will not be grumbling. While others are receiving their uh, bonuses and uh, rewards and benefits and grants, you will not be grumbling and complaining. It is high time you begin to do this and especially not only beneficiaries, well, everybody is a beneficiary in this sense, but especially the, the, the coordinators, the cluster head, the super coordinators and the cluster head. We don't know how UAG wants to direct this disbursement, whether it gets to the cluster heads or the super coordinators or the coordinators first or the sponsors before it gets to the applicant or it goes to individuals account directly bypassing all the heads and heads and heads whichever case it's going to be ensure that your account is valid ensure that it is not passive ensure that it has not been left redundant for some time and ensure also that you have lifted your limit it's quite so easy if there is a, a, a limit on your account not to receive certain amount of funds ensure to go to your banks and lift the limit once you get to the bank you might ask your bank how much can your account accommodate they will definitely be able to know and you don't know what you're expecting as of now all right so you can just tell them i want to increase the capacity of my account it's as simple as that if you need anything to be submitted they will tell you they're right there go and bring so 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 go and bring so 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 whatever you need to do to upgrade it and that is all so this is the pre disbursement memo coming to us at this time so that we can all be abreasted with what is going on internally and clean up our house get ourselves ready for that which is about to be delivered up uaag up disbursement of grant from st rita sorry from um sanctuary wealth uh, uh sanctuary wealth uh, multi-purpose cooperation you know and that is the organ of uaag so I congratulate everyone that is uh, in expectation of this and in no distant time we'll get the information on what next we are supposed to do. Thank you and God bless you. If you are yet to subscribe to this channel, kindly do so and hit the notification bell so that you don't get to miss out on any of our important updates. Thank you and God bless you.